Michael Lorenzen making his 13th start, Gibby. Yeah, he's been really, really good. Record does not reflect that. Fastball change to the lefty. Fastball slider gets the best defense from his outfielders in the game. Faces Edward Julian to start in a first pitch swing and a base hit to right. This is Donovan Solano. Punch to right center field. McKinstry surrounds it. And there's out number one. 1-1 one, one to Correa. Ground ball. Maton cut off Baez and turn two. That's well done. 5-4-3 double play ends the first. Tigers will bat in their half. And there is Bailey over making his 12th start. Not a good year for him. Got a late start to the season. Started the year in AAA, but has been really good. One away. Base is empty now for Spencer Torkelson. That's to center. And if Ober is on, we'll see a lot of fly ball outs. He's got two already. And base is empty for Kerry Carpenter. Taylor with another catch and a quick three up, three down, three fly ball out inning for Bailey Ober. Royce Lewis leads off of the Minnesota Twins, right handed hitting third baseman. Only 80 at bats so far. First pitch ground ball up the middle. <laughs> and behind the back grab by Lorenzen. He was pleasantly surprised to find the ball in his glove, <laughs> runs it toward first. One down, and now Kyle Farmer. Kyle Farmer goes down swinging. That's the first punch out of the day for Michael Lorenzen. Gallo will hit, hit his 12th home run of the year to center field last night. He gets rung up today. Gallo looks at strike three. A couple of punch outs for Lorenzen in the inning. Christian Vasquez leads off for the Minnesota Twins. This one to right center field, and that will drop safely. A leadoff hit for Vasquez. One and two to Taylor. Hit hard to center field. Riznik is back, tracking it. Still short of the track, able to make the catch. Vasquez trying to tag, and he is in there. An alert tag by Christian Vasquez, picking up 90 feet on the deep fly to center field. Left center field, slicing away from Riznik. Vasquez is... Going to try again. Christian Vasquez is safe at third. Well, we have seen the Twins run the bases aggressively, the likes of Castro, Taylor, and now Vasquez. And now here is Donovan Solano. And now a blast to left field. Solano's hit it well. Back to the wall and gone. All that hard work for Christian Vasquez for nothing. Well, Solano with a two-run blast. He got the trot home. <laughs> 103 off the bat, 420 feet into the wind there. That ball smoked left center gal. Hey, the ball hard his first time. A liner to right field. So Solano with a two-run home. Matt Veerling leads off the Tigers third to the right side. And under the glove of a sliding Kyle Farmer, Matt Veerling leads off the third with the Tigers' first hit of the day. Rogers delivers down like the left that. field line. That'll roll to the wall. Veerling's going to be held at third. Rogers trots in with a double. There Tigers starting to answer right back. Gibby, that's a good sign. Yeah, there, there you go right there. That's a mistake. It's right down the middle of the plate. Jake Rogers down into the corner. Veerling on his horse over to third. Jake on the second. Second strikeout for Bailey Ober today. Zach McKinstry. Down the right field line, and that'll do. Zach McKinstry will roll into second. He's got himself a two RBI double. We are tied at two. Check this swing out. I mean, this is incredible. This ball is right under his hands. Watch how he drops this bat head straight down towards the ground. Look at this. This is not a long swing. This ball is right in on his belly button. It's short down into the corner. Way to pick your teammate up. That ball is inside. Look at that. Straight down. That's, that's what they work on in the cage. Now Spencer Torkelson hoping to give the Tigers the lead. To center field for Taylor. McKinstry acted like he was tagging. Only to get the throw in. There are two away. Here we go, Carp. Let's go. Two away for Kerry Carpenter. Down the right field line again. McKinstry getting the wheel home. Here comes Gallo's throw. Not in time. Carpenter down to second. He's in there safely. The Tigers Interfere. have the lead. Line drive. Single to right off the changeup. McKinstry scores, and the Tigers take a 3-2 lead in the third. You called it. You said he's been on those off-speed pitches, those change-up. He's doing a good job of recognizing and keeping the bat through the zone a long time. He doesn't give up on it. He stays athletic. He extends his hands and reaches out to hit a line drive to right. Good base running all around. We got a game. We got a ball game. Two men aboard for Joey Gallo. Gallo pops this one up. Sky high. 
Baez drifting over. Let's it drop. It's the infield fly rule was in effect anyway. He just wanted to give the crowd a uh oh moment. That's all. Two away. It's Christian Vasquez who singled and rode home on the Donovan Solano homer in the third. Ground ball up the middle. Diving stop made by Baez. He'll try to get him at first. Wow. And he did. How did that just happen? Thought about eating it because he thought everyone was going to be safe. But then showed off the howitzer and gets Vasquez by a half a step to end the inning. Put that one on the highlight reel. Down goes Ibanez. Here's Matt Veerling. Here's the walk. A one out free pass for Veerling. He's aboard the second time today. Four stolen bases for Veerling so far this year. We'll keep an eye on with Rogers standing. Poke to right. Gallo. Diving catch in the corner. Little bit of a juggle, but it was when he was trying to pull the ball out. It's an out nonetheless. Nice play by Joey Gallo diving to his left. Well, he's got a gold glove out there, and it's plays like this that have gotten him to that point. Two down, and that'll bring up Lewis. And it's a walk. It'll be Jeffers hitting. Hot ground ball through the hole. Jeffers delivers. Lewis to second base, and that'll get switch hitting outfielder Willie Castro to the plate. Chopper to third. Off line and up the line, the run will score. Maton's throw off target, Lewis scores and we're tied. At the start of this inning with Solano at the plate, Maton threw up the line, Torkelson was still able to make the play and the tag, but an even worse throw here to get the game tied up. Well, high chopper, Maton knows how well Castro runs. That ball chopped into the ground, he had to stay back and feel that. Could have been bang bang at first, play, first base, but he had to wait back on that ball because of the high chop. Castro gets down the line well. And it's ball four, back to back walks. And that'll get Correa to the plate with a chance to forget all about his first four at bats. Line drive left field. Ibanez is there. Woo. And the inning is over. We head to the home half of the ninth. The Tigers and Twins are tied at three. And Matt Beerling draws a walk with two outs here in the bottom of the ninth inning. That brings up Jake Rogers. Correa will get a chance. Goes the short way to wrap up the ninth and we head to extras. Here in extra innings, Carlos Correa has speed, but not really a big force on the base pads. He is the extra inning runner at second base. Royce Lewis at the plate. Ground ball left side and off the glove of Maton. Correa to third. They're going to wave him around. The throw from Ibanez is not in time or in time, but not fielded by Rogers and Correa scores. The go ahead run Lewis to second base a late send by Tommy Watkins once he saw the ball trickle into left field very aggressive send by Tommy Watkins at third base but yeah that ball hits off Baton's glove and kind of you see a is way back there in left field yeah Rogers couldn't handle it now Jeffers beautiful and out at first with Lewis advancing to third and now with Castro who's been the twins best squeeze bunter now he will come up with one out and a runner at third liner off the glove of the second baseman into right field Castro delivers an RBI hit and the twins have a two run lead really good at bat from Castro ended up getting a slider in the strike zone he worked the count and got a mistake middle middle slider and ripped it hard infield in so not as much time to react Kirilov lines out to left two down and it's up to Christian Vasquez roll to the right side a base hit Castro around third he's coming in throw coming strong to the plate not in time it's a three run inning and Vasquez is thrown out at second base but after he drives in the third run of the inning Tigers down to their last out leaves it up to Spencer Torkelson 0 for 4 4 fly ball outs second baseman Solano throws him out and the twins take the series in Detroit well that's a team win right there it took everybody the bench is empty bullpen is almost empty but a good comeback good way to start the road trip walk out of here with a series win.